Hey everyone, it's Jess and I'm an opera singer. In today's video, we are going to be watching Morissette sing Never Enough. Let's go. I cannot believe she's about to sing this entire song sitting down. Oh, she looks beautiful. I'm trying to hold my push mm. One, seven, five Let it stay this way mm. Can't live this moment and Beautiful You set off a truth Getting loud she has a beautiful tone i love that i can hear all of the final consonants all of the d's all of the t's all of the n's within the words and i love the breathiness in her tone this last word that she just sang echoing i love that she gave a lot of release of air before singing the word can you hear it echoing so nice such a nice touch Okay, okay, I've got to pause. She has fantastic mouth positions to get all of those big open vowels up and out of her body. I would call what she's doing uh, technically proper. And what I mean by proper is she's adding a lot of length within her vowels. And by adding lateral space, in your vocal track, you're going to get a different set of harmonics based on the vowel and the note that you're singing. For example, when she's saying the word these hands, she went these hands. By adding more of an ah vowel into it, which she did, it calms down the brightness of the a ah vowel uh, and gives a different set of harmonics because she's added that lateral space of the ah vowel. And of course, you can sing it the other way with more of an a ah vowel in it, but you've got to keep in mind that you're going to get a different set of lower versus higher harmonics. And I love the way that she did it because I got a really good set of both low harmonics and high harmonics, which gave a beautiful balance of light versus darkness within that one note. So good. Let's rewind because I really want you all to hear what I heard. Okay, what she just did was so hard and she was consistently perfect each time. Okay, one thing that really helped her get up onto that high note in the word enough was how she prepared for it with the note directly before it. And you can see she has a lot of internal space on that uh, note before the high note. Uh, the word is enough. She's smart and saying enough. Uh, that I vowel is a lot more open than an E vowel. 
And by using the I vowel, uh, she's able to create a lot of extra space in her vocal tract, which then makes the move going to the higher note that much easier. Let's rewatch. <laughs> Okay, I have I have to go back. I have to go back. Her breath management is so solid. I love that she's not taking all of these extra breaths. And I love that she's just doing these beautiful, long, lustrous legato lines. I I cannot get enough. Eight. down dude she was singing eight count ten count phrases on a song that sits that high i'm over here tripping if a composer writes anything longer than eight counts in a phrase and she is doing this in this type of a song i could never utmost respect utmost respect her mixed voice and chest voice to me is aesthetically perfect i don't know where i've been this entire time but she's amazing. I hope you like this video. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on those bell notifications so you're aware when I put up a new video on YouTube. I will see you all soon. Bye-bye.